Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we will configure huge pages for database 19C, Oracle database. Because this configuration before uh, I make for huge pages, that was for previous versions uh, 12, till 12C. But this configuration is for database Oracle 9C on Linux. Configuring huge pages for Oracle on Linux 64-bit DB version 19C. Reduce overhead and improve performance are the benefits of using large memory pages for Oracle database SGA which is system global area. Oracle is using parameter use large pages to direct the behavior of an Oracle instance during startup. In the previous versions before Oracle 19C, we had three possible values for use large pages, use underscore large underscore pages. First one was true, second is false, third only. Since Oracle 11.2.0.3, the true means that the instance will allocate as many huge pages is free available in the system and get the rest from the normal small pages. The false would tell it to not use the huge pages at all and the only would be able to start an instance only if a sufficient number of free huge pages are available in the system to fit all SGA in it. The true is the default for all databases. This we was talking about for Oracle 11.2.0.3 and earlier. In the 19C version we got one more value auto underscore only and now it is the default value for exa data systems running oracle database 9c it specifies that during startup the instance will calculate and request the number of large pages it requires if the operating system can fulfill this request then the instance will start successfully if the operating system cannot fulfill this request then the instance will fail to start. Run the following command to determine the current huge page usage. cat slash proc slash meminfo pipe sign grep huge. It will show you the detail of huge pages. Here you can see that huge pages total is zero, free is zero, reserved is zero. It means huge pages are not in use. Now we will set up. So set up the use underscore large underscore pages parameter to auto only and restart the instance. Connect to database and run the command to check the value of the parameter. Show parameter large. It will show you use underscore large underscore pages value is true because it was default alter system now we will change the value so we will run the command alter system set use underscore large underscore pages equals auto underscore only sid star scope sv file means for all sids if it is cluster database otherwise you can skip this sid and you can write just scope sv file shut down the database then start up then we can see the huge pages were automatically configured on system to fit the SGA. We will run the command, same command again, cat slash proc slash meminfo pipe sign huge, uh, grep huge. Now you can see the huge pages total is showing the value and huge TLB also showing the values which means huge pages are configured and free which is showing huge pages free also three reserved also three means they are in use the database instance is able to change kernel configuration 
and allocate space in memory with 2 MB pages by itself without our intervention. And the number is exactly what is required to fit the SGA. What would happen if we shut down the database? The database is down but we still have the huge pages allocated from the memory and it seems like they will be there until reboot or somebody explicitly tries to change it. Here we, we will shut down the database and then after reboot we will run this command sysctl vm.nr underscore huge pages it will show us the existing value 2322 means it is still there means not automatically flushed if we start another database with the use underscore large underscore pages parameter for example set up to true then it will allocate huge pages for its SGA from the already configured now we will start up again and you can see it has allocated 2046 pages To check, we we have to run the command again. Cat proc maminfo pipe sign g refuge, and you can see the values. If we start our previous instance with use large pages auto only, it will count the rest of the available huge pages and add new ones to have two three two two pages to fit its SGA. Now we will do the quick summary. You can see in 19C it is very easy. Rekal will manage by itself everything. You just have to set the one parameter and a few pages will be automatically used. In previous versions we have to configure huge pages in sysctl file and then uh, we have to change the values in uh, security limits.conf. But in 19C we have to just set the parameter in Oracle and it will do the needful. Now quick summary is the database will configure and allocate new huge pages if it is possible on the system. The number of the new huge pages depends on SGA max size and available free huge pages already configured on the system. The number of allocated huge pages is not going down when the instance is stopped. The new parameter works not only on Exadata but on any non-engineered systems too. The default value for the use large pages parameter on Exadata system on 19C databases is auto only when it is true for any other systems. It means if it is not Exadata it will be true. Feasible to use on a very fluid system when you don't know in advance how many databases is going to be placed there. I would use it on the dev, mean development, test or sandbox environments. No need to calculate huge pages in advance, modify the kernel settings and apply them. All will be done automatically, must watch your memory. Not suitable to use the auto only on a system where you require full control on memory allocation. Simple error in SGA max size can lead to over allocation of the huge pages and memory starvation on the system, which means wrong settings or if you have multiple databases on in future you will have multiple databases in the same uh, server or multiple instances or multiple PDBs, then you have to configure it very carefully otherwise you will face the error which will cause over allocation of huge pages and memory starvation on the system okay this is uh, this topic is finished we will continue with next topics thank you for watching